There was a dramatic rescue off the shores of Lake Michigan near Saugatuck last night when a boat capsized and Holland Coast Guard crews sprung into action. The Coast Guard says this type of incident shows just how important it is to have communication while you're out on the water. 24 Hour News 8's Mark Thompson has the story. The call was relayed to the Holland Coast Guard crew just before 10 o'clock Saturday night. The initial report was of a vessel taking on water near the Saugatuck Pierhead. Boatswain mate Ryan Nagelkirk was coxswain or driver of the Coast Guard crew and says they couldn't locate the distressed boat at first, but then received word from the Sheriff's Department. The Allegan County was able to lift a GPS position off of a cell phone call from the vessel. Uh, moments before they lost communications with them, and then they passed us that position. Seas at the time were only two feet, but the fact that it was nearly dark out posed a challenge to the crew. In the valley between the waves, they were covered up, and so we couldn't see them until we were coming right up on them. Honing in on the voices of people yelling in the water, the crew finally located the capsized 24 foot recreation boat about three and a half miles northwest of the pier. Three people were found shaking and clinging to the hull of the boat. Two had on life jackets, one did not. The Coast Guard crew swung into action. We just come alongside and throw them a line. And we have them wrap the line around themselves and hold on to it, and then they just slide into the water and we pull them to the boat. Wet, cold, overjoyed, and grateful to the Coast Guard crew, the boaters were taken to shore. Nagelkirk says they may not have made it if they didn't have a radio or cell phone to communicate. Of course, life jackets are a must, and he says... Let people know when you're going out, um, you know, a family member or something like that, when you plan to be back, um, and just have some sort, of, some sort of way to notify someone if you are in trouble. In Saugatuck, Mark Thompson, 24-Hour News 8. The salvage company was sent out to recover the capsized boat. The three boaters were 28, 30, and 50-year-olds from Allegan and Otsego. Their names have not yet been released.